Hi, it's Slayer. Of course, it's my nickname. I'm from Geo Things, Taiwan, and I would like to share the, that uh, what we have done the, from this little island called Taiwan and uh, how we can contribute to the humanitarian response and the actions. Today, I would like to introduce the two tiers crowdsourced uh, for the disaster information collection. So first of all, the, the two tiers. So we quickly divided the crowdsourced information into like a, one part is not verified and another part is the trust information. So for the not verified parts, we need to do some further confirmation make a call or maybe do some very intelligent algorithm to analyze that. To us, we would like to enforce to make more trusted uh, report information from maybe government and from the NGOs and from the opinion leader. So today we will focus on what we have done for last uh, year is we collaborate with the NGOs and we try to generate, generate more trusted information from non-government organizations. So, First, we collaborate with the non-government organizations in Taiwan and we do the simulation with them together to allow them to know how the ICT can help them to like, enhance the efficiency for their daily operation and for the disaster response. And we also do the uh, like a training course. Believe in me, this is more exalted than I do the mini concert with my heavy metal band for like two hours or something like that. So we spend like several days to do the train, uh, like a training course and we get the amazing feedbacks. That's, so this is our first and the second version of applications. It's just we put everything we had on the application, the user interface. And then we got the uh, feedbacks that like, that's too complicated. So then uh, at the end, uh, we simplified that into only one circle. Everyone knows that click on the circle and you can do the instant report. That would be easy to understand and to do the instant report. We also deployed an like a, a Twitter style plus the GIS information situation desk for the administrator in NGOs. So all the instances will come in just like Twitter style timelines and the, the administrator can also dispatch the task according to their volunteer at the uh, front lines. So the volunteers, the responders, they will get the dispatched task uh, on their cell phone, no matter what kinds of cell phone they had, because the task is dispatched by geo tagged SMS. So what kind, uh, no matter what kinds of cell phone you had, you will have this, this dispatched information. And uh, of course, we also integrate the government information, just like the rainfall the information and the, the road block the information and so on. We integrate all this information and we are trying to do the transparent information like open data for every organization. And we even have the happy face map because NGO cares about the volunteer, if they are good, if they are safe or like that. So we decide the application, the volunteer can simply click, say, I'm okay or uh, I have trouble, like, like that. So we further to, to integrate different NGOs to like, uh, make those information more easier to share with each other, even with the government organization. So here's the idea about uh, how we harmonize the, the NGOs information, the trusted reports, and the uh, information from government, uh, even the, from the Taiwan uh, satellite uh, uh, images, and so on. And uh, we also deployed an Ushahidi to be the coordination platform. That allows the different NGOs to retweet what they receive, the trusted report to this open platform. Of course, the, everything is go open source and open data. So our idea is to make the NGOs can exchange information easily and quickly. And we would like to also like, uh, uh, like, like put in the public noise to make the NGO also do the verification, verification for those public noise. And further, we would like to invite them to respond to those reports to add to help 
those public needs. So we also designed an easy application about, uh, named iHelp for people who cannot speak, cannot uh, listen. That all they need to do is just simply click, click on the predefined information and that will send it to 911 in Taiwan and to our system. That's what we are trying to do uh, with ICT for humanitarian. I'm Slayer, I'm from Geosense Taiwan. Thank you.